Good afternoon, my beautiful neuromelanated family. I just wanted to come on for just a moment, just to remind you of uh, how beautiful you are. I'm out today doing some running around, uh, picking up some items that I needed. And um, enjoying this beautiful sun that's out today I'm always every chance I get to try and get some sun I take advantage of it because the sun is what powers us and so I am bathing in it today in and out of the stores that I'm um, shopping in and I just had a you know, my mind is always turning. I'm always thinking, pondering, and, um, you know, getting ideas. And and I had an idea to just pop on and say hello and remind you of some things. And the main thing is just to remind you of how beautiful you are and how wonderful you are and also how great you are. Sometimes we need reminding of that. And um, I just wanna thank the universe for providing for us on a daily basis as it does. Um, Mother Nature is making it easier for us. Mother Nature is clearing up some things and it's allowing us to open up our minds and our hearts and our soul to receive a lot of the things we haven't been able to uh, through the years. Well, we're, we're embarking on a new day, a new earth, as I always remind you guys. And in that, many of us are finding our way. We're healing we're um, claiming joy. Um, we're at different stages, but primarily that's, that's what the new earth is about. Uh, the new age of Aquarius is about. It's about us healing and um, uh, reclaiming our victory. It's already done, actually. We just got to realize it and walk in it. And that's what um, this age is about. It's a cleansing process. And if you notice, there's been a lot of um, trauma surfacing, a lot of um, mental things, mental illness, I hear some say that is surfacing all kinds of stuff that has been bombarding us for many, many years uh, that has been placed on us through spell work and all types of uh, negative um, energy processes. But we are just being forced to deal with it. We're being forced to fix it. We're being forced to work through it, you know, doing our shadow work and finding healing and peace and a lot of things. And one thing we need to realize, family, is that not all of our suffering has come from uh, our time in this life. Not all of our suffering has come from even our own parents. There is some suffering that has come down through the generations, some traumas. And um, so we are not, we can't just um, put it on one thing or the other. There are so many factors uh, in this process of how we got here and, um, and whatever it is that we need to do to move from it, which is what we're doing. And even if we can't articulate what we need to do or what we're doing, it's 
the process is taking place right now. So we just have to um, work on ourselves, continue. And the main thing is to know thyself, is to learn who we are, learn who we are as a people, uh, research and understand where we come from, and try and recognize the things that got us to where we are. And like I said, there's so many factors that we need to consider uh, as we process and then move forward to healing. Um, it's so many, so many things, you know, so many. Can't be even begin to name all of the um, factors in this process, but there are many. And um, we are not all to blame. We're not, you know, as an individual and things we've done, a lot of it is things that were actually, you know, out of our hands. Um, but we got tagged with being, um, deal, having to deal with the trauma of it. So it can get really deep. But we're doing it, family. And we just need to hold each other's hands and um, show grace and mercy for one another. And... Um, work on our heart chakra, and again, learn to unify and to love. And love is at the top. Love is the ultimate. And once we conquer those things, you know, we can move a whole lot faster um, to where we're trying, where we're uh, seeking to be. So I'm not going to stay on. Um, like I said, I'm. It's it's hot too. <laughs> guys and I'm in my car and I'm getting ready to get out and uh, go in a store and get a little bit more of this sun but I just wanted to pop in and you know who knows who may needed to have some uh, get some encouragement this this afternoon because um, we all need it from time to time um, I want to shout out my loved ones my my beautiful husband, my wonderful daughters, uh, Dion and uh, Desharmi, know that mama loves you with all of her heart. And there's no one more beautiful than you. You are my loves. And my, my handsome and wonderful husband, I just, no words. I, I just I thank the universe for you and all that you provide for us. I thank you. And to my family who, you know, we're linked together in this life. All of my family, not just my biological family, but this, all of you, all of you. I just want to thank you for whatever you may do to add to this collective uh, movement. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So I'm going to sign off, off <laughs> and complete my day. And I just want, want to say one more time, keep your head up. Continue to do what you do. It's all a process that we will make it through. And... I love you. Just know that someone out here, there's some somebody out here that loves you today. <laughs> I love you so much. I really, really do from my heart. So keep doing what you're doing. We'll, we'll make it. And I always say, like the video if it resonated with you. Share it and um, subscribe if you haven't already. Assalamu alaikum, namaste, and ashe, as I always say. Kisses. Have a great rest of the day, my lovies. Bye-bye.